Our paper sacks are used for packing powdery materials, but pouring such materials into sacks would take forever. Time is money, so to speed up the process, the powdery material has to be fluidized with air. This way, it can be transported into the sack via turbines or compressed air. And this is the moment of truth for every paper sack. The air must be able to penetrate the sack so that it is not torn apart by the pressure. That is why it's crucial that the paper has small holes, so-called perforations. Let's take a closer look at two different ways paper can be perforated. First up, the perforation under the valve. Holes are punched on the bottomer into all layers at the same time and in the same position. As a result, the holes are larger, but the number can be reduced as needed. Because the holes are large and in the same position, the filling material is blown out with the air. This creates a lot of dust during the filling process, leaving the sacks and surrounding area rather messy. Let's move on to the second method, full surface perforation. Here the layers are needled into the tuber one by one. More holes are made but they are smaller and not in the same position. During the process, the filling material is collected between the layers, which reduces the amount of dust and results in a cleaner filling process. But you have to remember one crucial thing. Holes do not improve the strength of the paper. On the contrary, both types of perforation weaken your sacks. One more than the other, but at least 15% of the sack's strength is lost. Therefore, there's always a trade-off between quick filling times and the risk of breakage. Fortunately, we have some good news for you. To get around this, you can use high porous paper instead. Due to the high breathability of the paper itself, perforation is not necessary. This also means that the risk of damage to the sack is kept to a minimum. Plus, your surroundings don't end up covered in dust. For further information, please get in touch with us or visit the Mondi Go to Sack app.